conference room with a view of the East River. He had sandwich platters out there and everything. And then I realized as he and his team are talking about all of these really amazing things they're doing, in this case in Africa, my students are totally disinterested in what he's talking about. And I'm like, what's going on here? And then I realized that they've never, ever been in a conference room, ever. They've seen it on TV, they've seen it in movies. They, they were like, they're like, wow, you know, this is a real wooden thing and there's like food and professional. And I, I felt so sad in a way, you know, but so happy in another way. But I think that kind of thing, David, it's like so important because students who are especially young students, but even college level students, the biggest challenge they have is not being able to see what's possible in life. And I think if we can break down that wall and at least open it up and be like, that is possible. It's not easy to get there. It's hard, but it's possible. I think that would be awesome. Yeah, I really do. And using entrepreneurship is not a huge jump because every day for poor kids start, you think about it. There you go. To eat, onboarding friends, to complete tasks, using resources uh, to survive. So every day is not a big jump. Can I just interject real quick? I know that um, my, so my children, my babies are Montessori babies and like that, like my, um, my aunt actually yeah. opened a Montessori school 